hi everybody this is fagun shah from integration lab and today i am going to show you how you can create custom gpt on your own and how you can use public connect as a backend for that particular uh, gpt right gpt is the latest feature launched by open ai and if you have chat gpt plus subscription which is 20 dollars per month uh, price then you should be able to create your own gpt right and let me first show you or demonstrate you what i have already achieved using it and then we will do a deep dive onto the setup as well okay so let's go to the gpt i have already created it is called pc multi actions okay now let me ask it in a normal english that what it can do okay so tell me what actions you can perform You can see I have already selected that uh, custom GPT here, right? And currently you are seeing that I am getting some extra stuff like processing and analyzing data and stuff, right? But uh, that is like a normal GPT thing. What we want is something different that we only want to know the actions which are actually possible via public connect only, right? I want only the actions which is available via open API schema provided to you right we only want the actions where API connections are possible so one is called sending emails another is called generating certificates right and yeah these are the two actions which we can perform right now let's say we want to do sending emails then how can we do that right like uh, let's say so we will ask it right i want to use or let's use the generating certificate first okay generating certificate action what you need from me so we are basically communicating with our workflows okay we are not submitting any forms we are not sending any data to be book nothing we are just communicating with our workflows okay so yeah it will check it and reply it to generate a certificate using gen uh, generating certificate action i will need the following information one is name uh, one of them is name uh, second is email and grade or achievement right so i will say nice uh, so the name of the student is let's say fagun test email is uh, i will do this one and grade is not so good this time but it is b plus right so i given the instruction in the normal plain english right and it will ask you to allow decline uh, that if you are sending data to public connect right and yeah that is what we are doing basically so it is like running the workflow here and here is the workflow uh, for that so i will just open both the workflows side by side here uh, and let's come back here this thing can take easily like one and a half minute as well sometimes so just keep the patience and you can see the certificate for Fagun test has been successfully generated here is the link to the certificate i want to see the image here itself one more thing i want to point out here that uh, all the gpts which you create by use default use uh, gpt4 so sometimes you will hit the limit every three hours okay so just be careful about that i was uh, facing that uh, error for last three hours now almost so just wanted to let you know that that can happen sometimes okay so yeah so now it says that it 
should be able to uh, show the image here it, uh, itself not by going to a particular uh, thing okay and by the way it also says that uh, it is already sent to the email address as well so why not we just uh, go to that particular uh, email address and let's see if uh, we have received the email or not right so if we go here so this was three hours ago so yeah it did not send the email or maybe i mistyped it but let me show you so however you can view the certificate directly by this link let's click on that link and fagun test b plus okay send this image of the certificate to uh, email id and let's do this email address with your choice of subject line and email body right so now it should use uh, send email action remember we had two actions available above sending emails and generating certificates so now it is talking to public connect one more time and yeah let's wait again this can take a uh, few minutes so just be patient hello so first it generates the data itself like email body email subject line then it sends that data to public connect workflow that will uh, take few seconds to run it and then it will come back with the result in a general english form okay not in a complicated so congratulations on your achievement here is the thing and here is the certificate uh, image right so yeah i mean i can always ask it for much more uh, fine tuned things but yeah currently i just wanted to show you how it actually works and yeah i hope this helps right uh, you can see how easy it is to like you know uh, to talk with your workflows right so if we go to create certificate history and you can see like it was executed four minutes ago right and yeah it is like literally talking to your workflows and nothing else right so yeah this is like super amazing and i hope that you guys uh, start uh, experimenting with this thing as well and i will create a detailed tutorial regarding how you can do this in public connect much more easily okay thank you